Hey Hot Wheels fans, it's Cynic X. I'm bringing you a new video. I'm sorry I haven't had much lately. I haven't really had time to go searching pegs and stuff, unfortunately. That real life thing gets in the way of the fun stuff at times. But uh, I finally got in my uh, F case. Um, this is the US F case, not international. Um, I have a subscription with One Stop Diecast, and so I'm getting all the US release stuff. So. Um, some of this stuff we've definitely seen before on uh, for K days, um, as well as you know. I know other people have posted videos. Some of them have posted them way earlier than me, but uh, better late than never, right? That and I don't know. I don't know about you guys, but I always think that watching case openings is very fun. So let's get to it. So let me let me do it this way. I'm gonna move the box. So that way, my lighting will be better for the actual cars. I don't need to light the box. So, first up is uh, the 07 Cadillac Escalade. Um, so, I bought one of those, if I remember correctly, over at Walmart. And, uh, you know, because I thought it was cool enough to get it early, even though I knew I was getting them. Um, Custom 69 Chevy pickup. Let me zoom in a little more. Get some better light. So, so pretty cool car. So, pretty sure that one's new. Might be wrong. Let's see. Well, wow, we're going way back. Cadillac 16 concept with the crazy rims. That was originally C case. So. Um, 2012 Mini Cooper Countryman Rally. Uh, that's one of the new ones, as you can see. So, very cool car. Um, Tarmac Attack. So, uh, new colorway for that. Um, so, good for the booster, for track stuff. Um, so I don't mind them. Outside of that, I don't particularly care. So, another 62 Chevy. So, sorry if you can't see the names of them that well. My, you know, I see, that might be a little better. So, um, 64 Buick Riviera, uh, non super edition. <laughs> so it's actually funny because I think that that edition, the the the, uh, the super, it's cool, but it's not like I'm like freaking out about it. Um, I don't think it looks much better than the plain one. So here's the car um, with new colors. It was originally green, and this one is uh, Hot Wheels yellow. So pretty cool looking. Flipmobile, we saw it in the K Days case, and that was back in E case, C e case, I forget. Might have been C. So, a very, very bent 24 hours. So, good track car. So, that'll be an opener for sure. Um, same with this 2013 Camaro Special Edition. I don't know, I really like the blue on this, um, which just lets you know if you're going to buy a Camaro, you can now get the uh, the Camaro package for $7,000. So, um, I don't know if, how many people are going to do it. If I had the money to blow, I would debate it. So, very beat up card. I just don't like the green nearly as much as the blue. I think the blue looks so slick. The green's not bad, but... It's, a, it's not holding my interest nearly as much as the blue. So, three of the custom Cadillac Fleetwoods. So, that might be a little better. Not zooming in so far. Apologize for that. So, pretty neat. Let's see what we got next. Let's see. Got another track car. Faradox, so those are pretty cool on the track. 
bought one of those. I bought a couple of track cars one day um, just to have for running through stuff. BMW M3. I don't know. I'm not super impressed with it. But it does say M3 on the back, which is sort of cool. I doubt you can see that, but it does say that back there. So that's sort of neat. Blue butt backslider. I've got like a million of the red ones, so now we'll start with blue. Hopefully future cases won't have so many of them. Um, Diesel Boy in yellow. The last revision of this was red. Oh, that one's cool. 70 Buick GSX. It says Melodin Inc. I don't know what Melodin is, but that is just a sweet looking car. I like how the, the tampos and the tire or the wheels match. So that is cool. Okay. Our buddy the combat medic, I showed you guys this a few weeks ago when I picked that up. Um, Lamborghini Gallardo LP570-4 Super Legra. So, always cool to have more Lamborghinis. I'm never going to complain about having Lamborghinis. If anybody's seen that new Lamborghini that they're coming out with that they're making 24 of for was it 2.4 million? Pretty nuts. Another diesel boy. 70 Chevelle SS wagon. So with the moon eyes. So that's cool. Uh, there's semi psycho. New colors. So such a weird truck. Truck esque vehicle. So, another backslider. I told you I'm going to get a ton of these in the next like, two months. Um, maximum leeway. I think I showed you guys that one before. I picked one up already um, just because it was a good track car. So, this is when I was getting Paradox and all. So, another maximum leeway. So, those will go in the bucket of uh, cars to play with. Um, another 68 Chevelle. So, glow in the dark variety. Got a lot of the, the glow in the dark ones. I got a lot more of them than the other color colors of them. Volkswagen Golf GTI in blue. So, it's weird because I got this case so late that I've seen so much of this stuff already. It's just like not very like surprising. So, maximum leeway, third one, so, that's fine. Um, another combat medic, so, let's see, two of the swamp buggy, so, I didn't get any from the 2012, um, so, it's pretty neat, I know it's weird, it's a, very much a kid car, but, you know, they're 97 cent cars, so they're all sort of kid cars, aren't they? <laughs> all right, let's see. We're going to the second level now. So, a couple of the Nitro Door Slammers. Um, these were originally an E case, so we're back with them um, for F, so in the white. Just fine. They're cool cars. I like them. Interesting. Batman Live Batmobile again, so with very, very narrow wheels. So it's interesting that they brought that back. I guess it's been really popular. Um, you know, I, I don't really care because I had got a ton of them when it first came out um, out of my case, but so looks like we got a couple more mystery machines. That's cool. So those are just fun cars. I think I'll actually give one to my wife and see if she want, would like one. She might, she might not. So, 64 Chevy Nova station wagon. This we saw at K Days. Um, still cool. Um, you know, the whole station wagon vibe. So, oh, looky at that. 64 Lincoln Continental convertible treasure hunt. Woo! So, 
I don't know. I, I like it. I just, you know, it's cool. I like the graffiti the style on, on it, but, you know, been unindated with it, I guess. Seeing it everywhere. So, 70 Plymouth, Plymouth AA Arcuda. That is awesome looking. I love that. So, I think I got one of those in the K-Days case. Maybe two. So, happy to have more because I think it looks really sharp. Okay. So, 2010 Ford Shelby GT500 Super Snake. We've seen you for a while. That was the case. Um, that was super. Uh, never. I still haven't gotten the super yet. Um, and I've been, like, I haven't seen it on the pegs or anything. So I just haven't. I'm not paying $25 for it. I don't. You know, I'm not paying eBay gouger prices. So I just. I'm waiting. Scorpedo. We've seen you before. So still a cool looking car. I like them. My kid likes them. Couple more of the WRX STIs with the yellow rims. Still have not seen this in the gold yet. So I doubt I will. But that's okay. I'm not a huge variation guy or anything. It's not my deal. Um, Scupa Dua Fuego with the dual color wheels. Blue on the front, red in the back. So. Fun stuff. Um, Trying to get pairs together when I can. A couple more of the 92 BMW M3. I love that casting. It's just so slick. It's just like, you know, real simple with the silver paint, but then like it has these nice like red and blue and black tempos on it. And the gold the gold wheels I just think accent it very nicely. So definitely one of the nicer castings of this year. Okay. Let's see. 70 Hemi Cuda, which we have seen before. Still a cool car. That's E case. So, and then Vendetta, cool car for uh, for wall tracks and everything. So, another opener. A lot of these are going to be openers, uh, but that's not a bad thing. It's better than them sitting in packaging. 69 Shelby GT500 in red. I like that. So that is pretty awesome. So happy to have gotten two of those. Let's see. A couple more of our buddy, the 72 Ford Gran Torino Sport. So. Fast gassing again. I think that was an E. So still neat. Sort of ridiculous, but. Speaking of fast gas, and there's another one. Uh, wow. So, some more 69 Chevelles. So, they really loaded up this case with a, with a lot of the older stuff. Um, which, you know, that's fine. It's like, you know, that gives people a chance to find stuff that they couldn't get before. Um, like this Chevrolet SS. It's like I remember when I first got that back in like D. Um, might have been D or C. Even. I only got like one of them and I was like, I was freaking out because I wanted so many more. And now it's like, you know, an overabundance of them, but I'm not going to complain because it's cool. Aston Martin DBS in white this time. So I think last time it was blue. So it's cool. It's an Aston Martin. If you had a real one, you wouldn't be complaining. So, Enzo Ferrari in yellow. It should be red. So I also saw pictures of the new Ferrari, La Ferrari, or whatever it's called, and just pretty awesome looking. So, Ford F one hundred and fifty, none, not with the red um, cap. So I feel sort of silly almost for having opened it when I got it because I only got one with the cap on it. Whatever. So here's our buddy with the Ferrari 458 Spider. So another cool car. And then 
Last but not least, we'll end with Ducati 1098R. So, it's so funny. This is the Ducati, all the motorcycles, I pretty much never open them when I get them because I can't run them on anything. And so they sit there. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So, that was the F case. Um, you know, like I said, we've seen a lot of this stuff before, but that, that happens. So, um, as usual, guys, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Hopefully, um, the stuff with Mattel will be coming quicker, like, or through One Stop Diecast. I don't think it's their fault. I think it's Mattel. But hopefully, stuff will be coming quicker in the coming weeks, months, what have you. So, but thank you guys for watching. As always, have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you soon.